Hello guys, welcome to class. If your emotion paint cracks, fades or loses white mark, the problem isn't your passion, it is your formulation. You see, paint production in 2025 and coming 2026 to 2027 is no longer about mixing chemical. It's about mastering chemical. And today I will show you the differences between old and new emotion paint formulation and how to fix fading cracking and white mark which is the major problem in dark color paint and how to produce a durable premium grade emotion paint that can stand the test of time so let's break it down by knowing what emotion paint is is all about for those of us that don't have an idea for those of us that have but we don't know what it is emotion paint is a water-based paint made from pigment binder and additive but its strength lies in how we balance these chemicals when it comes to your production process and we have two main types of emotion paints we have the slick emotion paint it is budget friendly smooth but not very durable and then we have the acrylic emotion paint which is flexible washable and long lasting um paint of course we have different grades of emotion paints you understand but this type alone doesn't define quality it is the grade that separates the average from excellency so now emotion paint belongs to one of four grades and that is to say number one we have the market grade which is a tiny cheap and it fits within a month and two we have the standard basic um, formulation which is strengthening and it's talking as well the third we have the premium rich and washable slightly it doesn't have mark issues then the fourth we have luxury crack free and durable advanced formula which you can combine all these formulas together. So most producers stay stuck at a market or standard for, um, process because they don't know how to balance binder, pigment, and filler. But once you learn how to balance chemistry, you can move from market level to mastering level. And you can also produce a quality market level. So each color behaves differently. If you produce all colors the same way, you will fail every time. Yes, especially when it comes to emotion paint and other uh, water-based paints. So for white emotion paint, you need more titanium dioxide for brightness and opacity and some other additives which are chemical. Number two is the gray emotion paint. So this particular emotion paint needs stabilizers to prevent white marks. And the third is cream emotion paint. Cream emotion paint needs pigment dispersion control to avoid fading. <laughs> you understand? So understanding your color chemistry is the secret to professional emotion paint. And I know a lot of people will say, hi Coach Gina, you talked about two main types of emotion paint. But we have weather shade emotion paint, we have matte um, emotion paint, we have um, slick um, emotion paint, we have um, mosquito um, repellent emotion paint. Are you saying that these other emotion paints are not emotion paint? Don't get me wrong. Every other types of emotion paint or fall down to only two main category of emotion paint, which is your acrylic emotion paint and your sleek emotion paint. So your mosquito repellent emotion paint can either be under acrylic emotion paint or sleek emotion paint. While your matte emotion paint could either be under sleek emotion paint or acrylic emotion paint. Every other type of emotion paint are grouped under these two categories. So don't get it wrong. So when someone reach out to you, your customers, your clients, or they want to um, get an emotion paint from you and they ask you, I want an emotion paint. And then you ask them, what type of emotion paint do you have? They say, ah, emotion paint is emo emotion paint. You tell them emotion paint is not emotion paint. We have different types of emotion paint and we have different grades of emotion paint. We have the budget friendly emotion paint, which is the market formula. We have the standard um, type of emotion paint. And then we have the premium type of emotion paint. And we have the specialized type of emotion paint paint you understand so you're able to tell them that emotion paint has a different grade and that is why it, it um you see a lot of emotion paint 
Now, then, or even now, the, the crack, aside cracking, you see an emotion pain after um, three weeks, one month, the color fades after rainy season. Or you see a dark gray emotion pain after painting, you see white marks on it. Not even dark gray, even darker color, you understand? So this has been a major problem um, and complaint from paint um, manufacturers and painters. And that is why you need to understand the chemistry of emotion paint. Emotion paint is very important. If you go through our YouTube channel, you see that I'm always talking about emotion paint. The reason I'm talking about emotion paint is that if you can get emotion paint right, you can get any other paint beautifully right. You understand? So let's fix the root problem. Number one, cracks. So too much calcium and not enough binder could make a motion paint crack. The second is fading. So weak uh, pigment and no colorescent chemical could make the paint fade. The second is white mark, which is over field formula, pigment imbalancing. And the last is powdery surfaces, which is wrong flame formulation. I know you don't understand all this, you know, that. but if your formula isn't balanced, your paint might look fine today, but it will fail in three months or even before three months. Now, let me show you what most producers are still using and why it is holding them back. So here is the old 2014 style formula most people still use today. So number one is calcium carbonate, 15 kg, water, 10 liters. Um, um, okay, um, carbon PT, 80 gram, PVA, 1 kg, formalin, 50 gram, ammonia, 20 gram, um caroline 100 gram and nitro saw which is a thickener 100 gram and colorant if it's a dark gray paint black paste 15 gram and of course we have our titanium dioxide 600 gram or one kg and we have our deformer 50 gram of course we have our jenny pot some persons don't add so our jelly pour 60 grams yes this formula works but it's outdated it cracks it fades and leaves white mark on dark color paint no matter how you produce it but the 2026 advanced formula uses improved binder ratio for elastic and adoration and of course added some additives for flame strength the right additives you control the pigment volume concentration which is your pvc to prevent trucking then you use an advanced dispensant and stabilizer for long-term durability can you yes sorry can you hear me and yes you have completed it all tested measured and simplified so inside the advanced emotion paint blueprint ebook so inside this new guide you will find every modern technique you need how to stop white um, mark gray and cream emotion formula anti-crack and anti-fade additives pvc control formula chart water resistant emotion system advanced mixing ratio for durability color retention method it's very important a lot of us are still struggling on how to go about getting color right for you so this is not just an ebook it is a paint factory blueprint once you know how to fix crap and fading your business transformed from trial to triumphant and let me tell you something this emotion paint um blueprint is a must have it's just going to be released today and of course there are three ways to produce paint one the chemical process how the ingredients re um, react secondly the scientific process how the flame 
on forms and totally technical process your personal trade secret my student know what the trade secret is all about so you understand but i'm going to create a video on it later on so when you master all three your paint stop being just paint it becomes your signature you understand and that is how um you build your own brand not just by mixing but mastering the process and how to produce a durable paint so if you've been using the old formula it is time to elevate because in 2026 the only paint that sells is the one that lasts you heard me the only paint that sells is the one that lasts so get the advanced 2026 emotion paint blueprint ebook and of course join our mentorship program where you learn how to produce so many wonderful paints and of course start producing paints that speaks quality not excuses because when you master paint you master your future and a lot of other paint uh, manufacturers or paint entrepreneur they know what i'm talking about so thank you once more for watching and remember to join our channel membership you understand also the link to get the 2026 emotion paint blueprint ebook will be in the description you understand so try to get yours immediately because we are giving out a discount launch price for this one because this ebook actually is coming out today so the earlier you get it the better from for you and at times most of the new ebooks once we give it out we stop um, giving it out over a time because we also want to um, protect our trade secret we don't want people getting our formulation and fabricating it and also giving it out wrongfully or selling it um wrongfully you understand so most of our formulation is going to be restricted coming 2026 you understand but we want our community to have the right formulation and the right knowledge and this knowledge is based on experience researching and problem solving you see i don't know how to explain this emotion blueprint ebook the 2026 i wish all my community members can get this emotion base and once you have it you are going to understand what i'm saying it's going to solve all the problem and also it's going to give you an idea how to handle all that water-based paint um production as well because in this ebook i teach down the mystery from scratch to professional i tell you the right thing you need to do and even if you want to go about um producing the market formulation which is the contract budget formulation you see a lot of people in lagos state they sell in motion paint maybe for twenty thousand to twenty five thousand in um other states um in the maybe delta state they sell emotion for seventeen thousand in abuja maybe they sell emotion paint for fifteen thousand in benin maybe they sell emotion paint for eleven thousand i'm talking about nigeria but when it comes to other countries you can see maybe in ethiopia they sell emotion paint 20 liters for um let's say um 40 dollars in liberia that they sell it for 150 dollars in the uk they could sell it for 250 pounds you understand and um in tanzania they, um, in kenya they could sell it for like um i think 1000 shillings you understand so in each every given um countries localities areas they have a specific price for emotion paint and they have different price so if in your country or in your area emotion paint is sold for a lesser price and you want to fit the market you want to produce a quality high emotion um, paint for an affordable low price the people call it cheap emotion paint low price emotion paint then you need to get this ebook because this ebook is going to teach you how to go about managing your chemicals the right way how to calculate your cost the right way and of course how to produce a more durable emotion paint at affordable price which a lot of manufacturers are dying to have so go to the link below and get yours now thank you for watching once more and bye for now